The home page of Zoho FSM has a dashboard that shows you real-time data in a bite-sized format. It summarizes the information you need to run your day. You can switch between the different views based on the data you want to see. Let's see how you can add a new service request. The request is the starting point in rendering a service. Requests contain job summaries, customer details, and preferences. Go to the request module under work order management. The create button lets you enter a new request. Fill out the summary, set a priority, and add a due date for the service. On entering customer details, you can access the assets linked to that customer. Mention the preferred date and time, add a note, and done. Now, you can turn this request into a work order or an estimate. Send estimates to customers to give them an idea of the cost. Click on Convert to Estimate and add details about the services requested and the parts required. The cost and taxes are populated automatically. You can now send this to your customer. Customers can approve estimates by clicking on the Accept button in the mail they receive. You can now turn it into a work order. Work orders are records that hold customer details, work details, and pricing details. It is the master document for your service. Apart from the details in the estimate, the work order has two additional sections, service tasks and skills. Under skills, you can see the expertise needed to do the job. Once the work order is created, you can use the Create Appointment button to add a service appointment. Service appointments contain details of the time of service, service location, and the field agent assigned for the job. Fill out the details and select a field agent to schedule. To handle all appointments and schedule efficiently, Zoho FSM comes with a dynamic dispatch console. The left pane consists of two views, the service appointment view and the work order view. The service appointment view shows the schedule's appointments. The work order view shows work orders that are yet to be scheduled. You can create a new work order here too. The right pane has three views, the Gantt, the Map, and the Calendar view. The Gantt chart has the names of field agents and crews in that territory. See their schedules, time-offs, and leave details here. Shift to the Week view to see their entire week. Use the map to see the job sites and the current locations of all your field agents. You can track the live locations of your field agents and filter them based on skills to select the right person for the job. The calendar view shows you all the appointments scheduled in that period across your organization. Here also you can switch between a day view and a week view. Schedule appointments by dragging and dropping from the left pane onto the Gantt or calendar. You can also move an appointment between field agents to reassign it and resize the box to reschedule. If a work order has multiple services or service tasks, you can use the checkboxes to select the services to schedule. You can also click on any point on the Gantt or the calendar to choose a work order and create an appointment. It is that simple. Once your schedules are in place, you can dispatch them to field agents. The Zoho FSM mobile app lets field agents stay connected and gives them all the job-related information in the palm of their hands. The home screen of the mobile app shows upcoming service appointments. Open it and scroll the top menu to reach the trips section. Here, field agents can start a new trip to log their travel time. The appointment overview screen has all the details of the job. Click on Start Work to start a timesheet. Timesheets can be paused, resumed, and stopped once the job is complete. While working, field agents can use the Notes tab to add notes and collaborate with the team at the office. They can also upload photos from the job site here. Once the work is complete, a service report can be generated summarizing the job. Service reports act as a bridge between the customer and the company. The customer can give their feedback and sign the report to show their satisfaction with the service experience. Powered by the Zoho Finance Suite, Zoho FSM supports easy invoicing and payments. You can turn work orders into detailed, branded invoices that you can mail to the customer. Field agents can raise invoices and record payments using the mobile app. 
To do this, go to the Work Orders tab and select a work order. Scroll to the Invoices section to create an invoice for the completed services. You can collect payments online or offline. Talking about billing and payments, Zoho FSM supports multiple currencies. Go to the Currency tab under Settings, Add Details, and set the exchange rate. Now, you can use them in estimates and invoices. Link Zoho FSM to Zoho Invoice or Zoho Books accounts to enable two-way data sync between the apps. You can do this in Setup under Billing. Configure Field Mapping and enable Sync to allow the flow of data. Tax details are added when you get started with Zoho FSM. To edit these or add other taxes and exemptions go to Tax Settings. You can also view the taxes you have set up here. If the services you offer are complex, involving multiple tasks and multiple field agents, use service tasks. A complex service can be split into smaller service tasks. These can be defined when you create the service in the Services and Parts module. While scheduling, you can create separate appointments for each task and assign them to different field agents. This helps in tracking the progress of work and measuring productivity. If you want to hide your pricing from field agents, you can turn the user into a limited field agent. Users are classified under the five default profiles provided by Zoho FSM. These are listed in profiles under Workforce in Settings. The admin has all the permissions, the call center agent handles requests, the dispatcher handles scheduling and the field agents work at the site. The limited field agent profile is similar to a field agent but has restricted permission and cannot see the pricing or create invoices. You can even create a custom profile and set up permissions that align with your organization's way of working. Go to Profiles inside Settings. Create a new one by cloning any profile. Make the necessary changes and save. You can now use this profile for your users. Zoho FSM helps you manage your multi-dimensional team with the Workforce module. View all your users in the User tab. Click on a name to view details. See their schedules on the calendar and their skills and territories from the respective tabs. Cruise lets you form a team that works together. Create a new crew by specifying the number of members and the territory. You can add members under crew members and make one of them the lead. The Trips tab details the trips made by the field agents. You can view their time offs under the Time Off tab. Zoho FSM also comes with built in reports. Go to the Reports tab to see them. Monitor request status, check the work orders to be invoiced, analyze trips made by your field agents, and keep an eye on their check in and check out times. Filter data in the reports and export them in the format of your choice. Zoho FSM can be tailored to fit the needs of your business. Build additional functionality and personalize your team's experience using customization components. You can also use automation to implement workflows specific to your business. Workflow rules, under automation, are conditions that can be satisfied to perform an action. Choose the module and use the prompts to define a rule. Next, choose the action. It can be a field update, email notification, or a custom function, based on the process you want to set up. Zoho FSM integrates seamlessly with other Zoho products to further strengthen your business operations. Handle inventory management by integrating Zoho FSM with Zoho Inventory. Choose the serial number of the part and the warehouse you procure it from in the work order. This will allow you to keep track of your stock. The Zoho FSM extension for Zoho CRM lets you connect sales and field service. You can view relevant information contextually in Zoho CRM. Create new requests, estimates, and work orders for an account or contact on CRM and view the records in the related list section. The extension also enables the two-way syncing of data between Zoho FSM and Zoho CRM. Besides this, you can use REST APIs to integrate with a host of third-party apps, SMS providers, accounting software, and more.
With this, we conclude our overview of Zoho FSM. Try out Zoho FSM for your field service organization. We offer a pricing plan based on number of appointments to align with the needs of your business. Start your free trial by visiting www.zoho.com slash FSM slash. For other queries, write to us at support at zohofsm.com.